good morning welcome back to our channel uh, today is day 4 in uh, rajasthan so uh, currently we are at jodhpur um, we stayed in this hotel as a stopover because our end destination is jaisalmer um, so today's uh, quick itinerary is uh, uh, we will be visiting mehrangarh fort uh, in uh, jodhpur and uh, if uh, we have time uh, we will go to the jaswantada also uh, if not uh, then we will head towards uh, jaisalmer uh, the plan is to reach jaisalmer by around 3:30 so that we don't miss any events there um, we have camel ride desert safari um, and uh, a desert music and dance show planned um, so let's see how much of it uh, we can cover today the current time is about 8:45 we are done with our breakfast we ordered poha puri bhaji um, and coffee and uh, chai um, i think we give 9 uh, on 10 for chai while uh, coffee is just fired of 10 um, but otherwise we are done with our breakfast uh, we are waiting for uh, our check out and the plan is to check out by uh, 9 am if you are new to the channel uh, please share subscribe uh, to our channel and like our videos uh, please pass on the link to your friends and family um, thank you so people time is 9:15 and uh, we are heading to mehrangarh fort which is about 15 minutes drive from the location where we are staying so let's go Uh, Meheran Gird, also known as uh, Meheran Fort, was built by uh, Rao Jodha in uh, in 1459 in Jodhpur. This fort is one of the largest uh, in the country. It is situated on an elevated mountain, which is about uh, 401 feet uh, above. So the entry fees uh, for this fort is uh, 200 per person. and if you have senior citizens you get a discount of 100 rupees then you also have a elevator to go to the top uh, which is 50 rupees per person um, and then uh, you can also take guide service again they have guide uh, service also um, which is like um, one to four people it is below 500 and 5 to 10 is about 600 rupees Although Rao Jodha laid the foundation in 1459 the palace was built over 500 years by different rulers and different parts of the fort represent a different era when you walk through the gates and corridors you will certainly notice the change in architecture which reflects a deep rooted history hidden behind those walls There are about four mahals in the palace: Moti Mahal, Shish Mahal, Phool Mahal, and the Janaki Mahal. Moti Mahal is the largest period room of Mehrangarh Museum. Shish Mahal of Mehrangarh Fort is a typical example of Rajput Shish Mahal, and it has a beautiful mirror work. Well, Maharaja Abhay Singh built the Phool Mahal. It is one of the grandest Mehrangarh Fort period rooms. It is believed that Phool Mahal was a private and exclusive chamber for pleasure. We had a 
very good guide accompanying us. We will give the guide details in our uh, blog uh, description. Um, but uh, totally thoroughly enjoyed Mehrangarh fort. Uh, it left us with mesmerized views, and we were very amused imagining how well the handcrafted work is. Hello, welcome back to Aditi's Instagrammable Corner. We are currently at Mehrangarh Fort in Jodhpur. Um, I have to say this is one of the most beautiful places I have ever seen in my entire life. The craftsmanship and the handiwork of the stone is literally one of the most beautiful things. It's so gorgeous and it's so interesting to see that like thousands of people worked on this for hundreds of years to make this fort as beautiful as it is. In terms of Instagram ability, I would rank this above the Kumbhagar fort that we went to on the outskirts of Udaipur. Um, if I gave that a seven, I would give this like an eight and a half or a nine. Honestly, I got some gorgeous pictures of the stonework. So if you want some really pretty architecture, some really pretty handiwork on your feed, this place is the place to be. So we visited the Mehrangar Fort and right now the time is 11.15 so we are, uh, run, we are running late so we cancelled to visit uh, the Jason Tada uh, as we have to reach uh, Jason by at least uh, 3 o'clock so that we can go there and enjoy the sunset uh, at the sand dunes. So we are heading towards Jaisalmer now. So Jaisalmer is about uh, 250 km from Jodhpur and uh, it might take around uh, 4 to 5 hours of uh, journey time. So let's go. We are currently in Jaisalmer. We drove here from Jodhpur, which is a five-hour journey. We're, it's exactly 4.43 p.m. and we just got here. We are currently staying at the Desert Springs Resort, which is about 80 kilometers on the outskirts of Jaisalmer. Um, it's in the Sum Sand Dunes, um, is what it's called here. Um, our package includes camel riding, a jeep safari, um, an entertainment program, like a cultural entertainment program at night, a high tea, a barbecue for dinner, um, and breakfast in the morning. And that all total comes out to about 14,000 a night for the tent that we have. So we are at the sand dunes, uh, finally. So this was uh, uh, the most important piece of our uh, whole Rajasthan trip, which we actually uh, did for our niece. We planned it uh, for her. Um, so sand dunes, um, it, my, this is my first experience with the sand. Um, and uh, 
currently as i said we came on the camel uh, riding to the sunset spot so you can see behind me um the sunset has started um and then now uh, if you see behind me i don't know if you are able to see that's our desert camp um so thoroughly we have enjoyed the sand sand is so cool um i mean it's very cold so interesting though it's so hot in the morning when you come to watch the sunset the sand is just cold